guys, it's Noah Wilson here from iHollywood TV, and we're going to chat with some of your favorite stars here at the premiere of Dirty Sexy Saint in New York City. Let's go. enjoyed being able to portray a woman that knows what she wants and is kind of unapologetic about getting it. She knows she can work hard, she knows she wants love as well, and she can do both. And I think that to play a character like that, I mean, what more could you ask for? I know that I don't have the right to ask this, but could I stay here until I figure things out? I won't be in your way and I can sleep on your couch and I swear you won't even know I'm here. I have no money. No place to stay. I can't even buy a meal or a hotel room. Obviously, I didn't think things through last night, but I don't regret leaving home, and I am determined to make it on my own. Mm. I could work in your bar and make some money until I have enough to get a place of my own, which shouldn't take too long. Please. Uh, Samantha, I don't think that's such a good idea. Please, Clay, I just need someone to give me the chance to prove myself. Well, I hope that they love it as much as the book, of course. Um, and I hope they have fun and they, they, they feel like they've fallen in love as the characters fall in love. I think what I hope the audiences will take away uh, from the movie itself is like the importance of passion. Um, in everything in life, but I think particularly in, in relationships, I think passion is something to be celebrated and, and looked for and, um, and reveled in. So um, that's what I hope they'll take away from it. Uh, I think we have a wonderful cast of people and an incredible crew as well who really brought this story to life in a way that, that will get that message across. It'll be hot. It'll be hot. What's up, Levi? I take you to talk to Mason? Not personally. Though he did text me to tell me you have a woman living with you. You think big news like that would come directly from you instead? She's not living with me in the way that you mean. It doesn't matter why she's living with you. The fact that you let a woman stay in your place for more than one night is quite uh, shocking and fascinating. Okay, she didn't have anywhere else to go. I'm just helping her get back on her feet. Oh, that's very charitable of you. Hey, can I get two shots of whiskey and a couple of... I take it she's the gorgeous blonde over there? Yeah, it's her. Samantha also known as Cupcake. What was exciting about it, and uh, beside getting to work with Tosca Musk and Jennifer Chan, and uh, I mean, the story was great, um, but I had been wanting to work on a project about brothers, but mainly friendship. So the three brothers, I play one of the brothers again, Levi, and it's just a, a story of like a good camaraderie of brothers and mainly friendship, so. What I love about this particular movie is that our female character is so empowered in her own need to find herself in the world and um, is in, has sort of left her uh, wealthy world that she's in to, to just go and work in the real world and discover herself and she does and then she just finds this person that she immediately is attracted to and decides to, to cling on to him with all she can and, and she does and it's, it's really fun and exciting. It's my, um, it's my version of a Hallmark movie. You know, what I hope that they take away from this is that we should all ask for what we want and um, seek out what we want in life and make sure that we get it because that's the only way that we can be happy. And so whether that's, um, you know, as, as our female character here is, she's a pastry chef. So whether it's being a pastry chef or whether it's being a mom or whether it's being a CEO, go out there and make sure that you are going towards the thing that you really want to be. Just like you, I, love, I remember meeting you when you were so young and sweet and innocent. And now I'm like, well, you're still sweet and innocent, but, and young. <laughs> And you're interviewing all the A-list stars out there. I love it. I'm just so, I'm just, I love watching your growth and your, just everything that's going on with you just makes me so excited and I, I'm so happy for you. It just, I'm, I'm so glad to be Facebook friends with you.